You was friends with J Money? That's somebody name that we always hear in the songs too. Oh yeah, J Money, that was my boy. For sure. That's why um J Money was the reason I um I I got this on my neck or whatever. Mm. It really was from J Money. We used to hang together a lot. And then he passed, he my brother. Then I just wanna get some on me to always, you know, remember you know? Yeah. So that's what I got. Boom, I got the same tag, got yeah, type. Yeah. What's your, uh, yeah, I still got a relationship with like Asian though? Asian cool. Asian cool. You know, I know, uh, we ain't be around and stuff like that. I mean, Asian, we don't talk yeah. like that, but Asian cool. Did you know her before Vaughn? Did I know her before Vaughn? Yeah. No, uh, no, we uh, I probably, probably at the, probably, probably met at the same time. Me and Vaughn probably was together. Vaughn met, we met at the same time, type shit. Same, same time. You know, or Vaughn well, could have already met her. You know, before me, I already know. I can't say I met her first or whatever. We probably met at the same time. How you feel about herself? About her calling herself the king, uh, the queen of Drew? You feel like she earned that title? You know, you got people like Katie got bands and everybody from Chicago that's was doing the drill before her. But she been going around saying she the queen of drill. Like she get that. <laughs> I don't know about no um I ain't never know about no no girl trying to I don't need to be taking them serious. Me personally, but she be doing her thing with the yeah, drill yeah. music, for sure. To she be fair, she, she kinda like did the Chicago drill and then she's been affiliated with all these like New York drill artists too and she's from fucking Texas so she's definitely covered a lot of drill territory even though she's yeah. not really from that kind of she come off she come off street gangster she come off gangster she called me a creep the other day on live I don't know why I mean we did like review Watch our only fans. yeah so I guess that might be it but <laughs> she says she's like I used to fuck with Adam and now he weird like what she said she had OnlyFans. I asked her if she wanted to collab. What's the big deal? Oh, you did? I didn't know that. I, th I mean, I think at some point I made it clear that I was trying to work with her. But, you know, if she's not ready for that, that's fine. I was just trying to make some content. You know, I'm a content creator. How y'all feel about her having OnlyFans? I ain't a big deal. I ain't know she had one. She got one? Yeah, she got one. She whooping on there. Yeah, sure. Yeah, we seen it. Me and uh, J-Man checked it out together. Oh, damn. We were oh. whooping. I don't know. That ain't <laughs> shit. We whooped too. I don't know. I ain't never watched no OnlyFans. For real? I ain't never watched no, no OnlyFans. Damn my life. Really? I swear. Good I stuff out there. Yeah, it probably is. That's how you get the premium content. Oh, the premium content. That's, <laughs> on, that's the only thing you have to. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, sometimes you want to go beyond Pornhub. But that's just me. For sure. Who created Get Back Game? Like, who came up with that whole. The name of the rap group or what which I got going on? I don't know, I think uh, I don't know. Shit, Vaughn just started using it heavy, you know, private. You know, I don't know who put it on the internet, all that shit, but Vaughn used to use it. The get back gang shit. Yeah. 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 Another thing before we leave, I gotta ask y'all about T Roy. T Roy one of the famous names everybody talk about. What was your relationship with uh T Roy? I was friends coming up. Yeah, T Roy. Yeah, yeah. T Roy used to be. T Roy used to be the same. T Roy used to be hanging with Sosa a lot. You know, they used to be cool. They used to be around each other. Tough. You know, we used to all. We all know each other, but then you know. But they was the ones locked in. They like they they they. You know, it, it's always be like that. You know how it be. Yeah. You know, you got you got it. You know, everybody cool, everybody homie, but then you know you probably the people might see you with this person and that person. More do you see, more, you know what I mean? So that's how it was. Everybody at CT Roy, him, they got to, you know, yeah, they was on that type of time back then, you know, just in parties, turn and shit like that. First ones, just comfortable in parties. They used to know? be dancing and shit out here, right? They used to be just, 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 just turning the parties up type shit, you know. Where everybody, you know, want to, you know, act like they a certain way, like come out a certain way. They used to be already, like, basically on that, like they already artists this type shit, 
So they already live in the party, doing a lot of little shit to turn the party up. T. Where had did music? He was dropping music. Like, no, oh. no, yeah, no, hell no, he ain't never. He ain't never dropped no music. He used to rap. He can't rap for shit. Are you like, I don't know, like if you start putting music out, are you gonna like be really serious about it, or are you just gonna put out one song and just see what? No, nah, I'm finna, um, I'm finna, I'm finna drop. I'm finna see. Hopefully the people fucking with me. Cause I'm definitely finna take the time out to drop and really take it serious. You see what I'm saying? So I'm gonna make sure it's right. I'm gonna make sure it's right. So hopefully they, hopefully they show me some love. Yeah, I think everybody like gonna none. be tuned in. You know what I'm saying? You you've been we've been seeing you behind the scenes for a minute, so I feel like it's only right that you do some music. Yeah, for sure. They've been trying to get me to they've been trying to get me to do some music for the longest. They've been trying to get me to do some music for the longest. Yeah. Everybody been in my DM ear since, you know, they see me with Vaughn, you know, because, mind you, we used to be everywhere together, you know. Vaughn used to do a lot of shows. I don't know where them bitches used to be coming from, but them bitches coming. And we all over. We all over. So when they started seeing me on stage, on his live, just air all over. So it's like, they always like, trying to, you know, like that. What kind of shit. role did you play when you were on the road with him like that? Like, I mean, I play like a shit. Damn, they're like I'm next to I'm next to people like it's like track now, you know. Track is manager, but like I'm next to track, you know. It's like we right there, we right there doing that thing, you know. Track is manager, track handling, it, but in that lane, I'm I'm intelligent enough to handle that lane too. I'm next, like learning from track, doing certain things. Why Vaughn was why Vaughn was on tour and shit, yeah. I had that important role. Like I was just close. Like he was just relying on me a lot, just with a lot of shit. Not saying I rapped, but just just my just my thought, just my idea, everything. He just, you know, just depended on he had faith in type shit. 